Hi, in this tutorial, we are going to learn basic uh, meshing in ANSYS Workbench. So, we are going to open now double click on model. So first we have learned about geometry, how to apply material to geometry, second how to add customized material, how to add the coordinates uh, systems and this uh, contacts. So next one is meshing. So in this tutorial we are going to learn basic meshing. So what we will do, we will right click here and generate mesh. So you can see this is just a rough kind of meshing. So if you want to refine this meshing, then what we can do? First, we will click here and we are going to change element side, side to 6.35 mm and we will keep this adaptive sizing to yes. Now we are we have changed this global matching element size. So update mesh. Mm -hmm. So you can see now matching has been refined as comparison to earlier one. Another we will try here. Keeping this adaptive sizing, no. And uh, this capture curvature, curvature to yes. And we are going to, first we will see keeping this same. So now you can see some difference other thing what we are going to change now we are changing the size of this one keeping curvature capture curvature two years we are going to change to 3 mm <coughs> update See, now it has been refined. And also you can go downside and you can see how many nodes are there. Nodes is around 3,17,957 elements is also around 1,78,048. So, if the meshing is ref refined, mesh is refined one, then it will take more time to solve the problem. So, depending on the time and uh, time available and this system capacity, we can refine meshing accordingly and the accuracy of the results. So, if the meshing is refined one, the results will also be accurate. If you want to refine uh, sizing of a particular area, then we can add insert sizing. Sizing and what we are going to select here, we are going to select face and we want to uh, we want to refine this area 
press control this one this one here apply and element size we can refine to one now we can generate update So here you can see it has been refined and element size we have kept here one and add the other portion it is three. So uh, if you want to get accurate results at the particular area there we can refine the mesh accordingly. So this is the basic tutorial about the meshing. So we will learn more uh, about the meshing in the in the advanced tutorial so okay thank you